nearby checkpoint in Paris, California, a lady said they're towing cars like crazy. Well, there's one, there's two. So, it does appear they might be towing a lot of cars tonight. And uh, we're gonna try to get through here without being in their way. I'm gonna have to walk through their checkpoint. There's no way across the street, I'll just walk through real quick. I need to get over that side. Yeah, let me walk through. I don't want to be in their way. So we're gonna get out of here out of their way. Get out of their way. All right, make sure everybody's. So this is the checkpoint, it's up here. Um, I thought it was down farther south, but it's right here. So they have the cars over here, and I guess they're turning them in right here. And uh, got a lot of cars lined up down here. So like you saw, there's two on the tow truck. And the one lady said, yeah, they're towing them like crazy. So. <coughs> and what I need to do is get over on the other side over there so I can see the DUI checkpoints and so forth. I got deputies here. They said, hold the line. Oh, okay. Is he here for transport? Oh, citizens patrol. Yeah, nothing. All right, so I need to get over on the other side over there. I'm not seeing much from right here. It's a bad vantage point. Like you said, we got all the cars here. Quite a few of them. People are packing their stuff up over here. Looks like they might be towing the cars. <coughs> They're checking them here. <coughs> and, uh, we're on the wrong side of the road. So let me cross real quick. There's nobody. He's gonna wait right there. So right here, they got the intersection closed off. Here at Ryder Street and Ramona Expressway. I didn't know they crossed. I guess they do. So we're gonna get out of their way so they can conduct business. <laughs> oh, that takes me back to the army days. Okay. So we'll stand here out of their way. But as you see, we have people packing up their stuff as they're towing these vehicles. Um, like I said, there was two down here already being towed. Somebody, a bunch of people are packed no, maybe that's sheriff stuff there, but that's not. That poor gentleman has packed up his bags in order to have his car towed. So, and if I do need to go get the camera, I will. I have my camera tonight and tripod. In the instance my phone starts, the battery starts getting low. Uh, I could go get the camera and tripod now. I'll wait a minute. Uh, but I can set it up right here for you guys. It's just easier to use my phone. I'll use my phone for a little while because I do have a microphone for it. The camera's got a good microphone, but it also picks up background. Whereas my microphone here does not pick up a bunch of background. So. But it looks like they've towed several cars tonight and towing more. And where I parked my vehicle, there were four or five cars parked there. And I think a couple of them said they got their cars towed and people had come to meet him here, give him a ride home. So. But I think the guy in plain clothes over there, the gray haired gentleman works for the city. I believe that's city, I don't know, that's all his stuff. Don't tell me they're towing that truck. Maybe they are towing it. Is that his work truck? We'll see in a minute. We will get the end of the story here in just a second. But we're out here. Watching this unfold. I was at another driver's license DUI checkpoint tonight over in Eastvale. 
which is right next to Norco. And that one was just basically a driver's license check. I mean, if somebody had a suspended or expired driver's license, they said, does the passenger have one? Yeah, they were just switching them out and letting them drive. Um, it's a good thing. I, I don't know that they're going to tow any vehicles over at that checkpoint tonight. But the one over here, from what I hear, it looks like Bob's car lot out here, or did for a little bit to put the lady down the street or the cars they're towing. So we'll see. Like I said, there were two loaded up when we walked by. You guys saw those. He's got his stuff packed up over here. <coughs> and it looks like it's gonna be a busy night for the tow drivers. Another car pulling in. I love that smell of that generator down there. I do, it takes me back to my army days. I think I said that last night while I'm saying it tonight. Because it does, man. 11 o'clock at night, I'm standing out here with a generator going and I can smell fuel. <laughs> so it's like, takes me back, man. Germany. 30 second signal battalion. Hoorah. I was also in the um, 32nd ADCOM, which is Army Air Defense Command, and the 11th Signal Battalion in Darmstadt, Germany. So the 32nd Signal was in Hoechst, which is a part of Frankfurt. So Hoechst to Frankfurt is sort of kind of like uh, Hollywood to Los Angeles. its own little city but it's within Frankfurt I've already got some looks already got some looks now at the other one in uh, Eastvale those deputies were really friendly they're all waving saying hi I come here to Paris and they're all like what the hell is that guy doing here I had to but I had to walk through right there across the street I just said fuck it I'm walking I'm media and then I got up there and like, as you guys saw, I realized I didn't have a good vantage point. So I crossed over and came here. Okay, not a lot going on right now. So I'm gonna cut this. And I, so you're gonna see some cuts tonight in here, jump cuts. It's not cause I'm editing out anything that you guys need to see. It's cause I'm editing out all the downtime where we're just standing here. Gonna give you guys the exciting stuff tonight. And I don't know, sounds like we're gonna have a little bit of action. Rattle, rattle, rattle. All right, all right, all right. News now, yeah, Kaipa. So the tow driver just jumped into this white car. He's going to back it out and drive it. And then the poor guy in the hoodie over there has to walk home with all his crap. Um, unless he's called somebody to come get him. Hopefully he has a ride somewhere. We have somebody walking up here. You'll see in just a second. I'm going to pan across see her with a deputy walking but um that's a driver but he's going down here to tow this guy's car that he just impounded and this guy gets to walk and on my playlist if you're looking for this dui stop uh, tomorrow, it will be called the Ramona Expressway DUI checkpoint in Paris. Paris. Forget Paris. I think it's gonna rain, guys. It feels like it. At least I have an iPhone 8. If it gets wet, it'll be fine. I'll 
And somebody just said relax. I'm like, what? You don't say relax around here, man. People look and think someone's getting arrested. What's up with that? You guys ever see Total Recall? Remember Total Recall with Arnold Schwarzenegger? Total Recall, guys. Johnny Cab. <laughs> Total Recall. Johnny Cab. <laughs> Total Recall. <laughs> Johnny Cab. <laughs> that is total recall. <laughs> oh, man. That was totally total recall. Johnny Cab. <laughs> that, that, was worth, that was worth doing this checkpoint for right there. Just to see Johnny Cab. <laughs> I think it was Johnny Cab. Correct me if I'm wrong, guys. All you Arnold Schwarzenegger fans. If it was not Johnny Cobb, tell me what Cobb it was. That was funny. That was worth it. Just to see that. 